Okay, guys, uh, welcome to You Define New Creations. And today, I'm going to get rid of my out of the way. Um, these are my new geode coasters, which I'm excited to use. But second of all, I made um, holographic inserts. So I'm super excited to see how they turned out. So, so we're going to do a 3D bloom. And um, teal and pink. I'm going to keep it simple and see how. It looks. Um, this is some new um, ink I got today. It's Pris Prismatic. It's really pretty. Um, that's the only one I ordered because I wanted to try it before I ordered some more. So, but I will link it in my description below. And this for my center is just the Super Full. I'm using it because it don't go anywhere. And we all know how I am with when I try to put that hollow glitter in the middle. It just tries to run away. So, I'm going to do this today. So, I don't go nowhere. I'm so excited to see how these turned out. I'm not going to be in here like 50 times today to check them. <laughs> and it's daytime. Who knew I would be up crafting during the daytime hours. So I don't have to be quiet because I'm home alone today. Well, Remy, my dog, he's sitting outside the door. He gets a little mad when I shut the door and won't let him in. But this isn't safe for him to be around. And second, um, he gives me enough of his hair on me to bring in here. <laughs> I definitely don't want him in here. <laughs> Poor thing. He'll sit out there and act like he's dying. Bless his heart. Illuminate white, of course. And we're going to start out with pink around. It's kind of, the pink's kind of hard to see against these pink coasters. But... I've been wanting some of these pink ones forever. Oh, I finally ordered them. Oh crap. It'll be alright. Let's see if I can push it back over here. I didn't mean to mess up the the blooming. I want to pull that off of it. Oh, there's my spot. There's, there's my pink. Oh. Okay. And now, the teal. Which I am excited about this one because I love teal. new uh, pan out to use. <laughs> I'm just all this teal around. I don't know if it's because it's on the pink. It'll look like maybe it's just a dark teal. I don't know. I don't really want to get in the pink. That part just decided it wanted to, so... the edge as possible. Get this one up. So it won't break up. Oh no, that was a good deal. Just more on the outside <laughs> because apparently it's wanting to move on the in move to the inside. It's not what I want. I'm just gonna pull to the center either way. I 
so excited <clears throat> to see these. And so they're going to be in here checking them. That is a pretty peel. You see that? <laughs> it's got a little pink mix with it, but it's pretty. All right. I'm going to speak. Put some little dabs. Lemonade white. This is alcohol ink. Usually the dye is the one that stays in the dots. Well, that's kind of interesting. Pretty milky white. I'm gonna add a little bit more orange in. Look at my bag already. I know I'm not gonna need all that white. But I can always do something with it, of course. I have me a, um, <laughs> it's an ashtray over here that is collecting all of my leftovers. So, that's going to be kind of interesting to see because it has, like, every color that I use in there. When it's not a lot, I put it in there. When it's a lot, I, um, try to find something else to do with it. So if it's just a little bit of resin with some glitter, then I definitely, yeah, I'm not going to need all those. Um, when it's definitely just a little bit of glitter, it doesn't bother me. My little scissors aren't working. I'm cutting it because I have a napkin in my lap down here. I just cut a little hole. Well, not little. I wanted it to be big blooms. So, here we go. Oh yeah, that's a pretty teal. Oops, I will never forget that because you know I am. I totally dipped in that one. Stuck my popping bag in the other one. Yeah, I have plenty, plenty left. I could do several more. Let's see what that one is. Just spray at it. And that's where that one started. Where they start, I like to kind of pull it around because it's always a blob right there. I know I'm weird. <laughs> All right, so let's see. I'm making some blooms. The light is already sinking. <laughs> um, I forgot where I was. I'll clean that off in a minute because you know I like to pull them over the side. It gives it that, I think it gives it that pointy look. Pull some of the pink with it. I don't know if that's a good thing that it's already sank to the bottom. Some of it has, some of it hasn't. I've never really had it to sink like that. I'm assuming it's probably because of this um, new teal. Maybe. Do I know? Okay. 
I can just all over my hands. And then the one thing I like about the full in and out, it, it don't go wandering. <laughs> Y'all know I have that problem with keeping it in the center. All right, I'm gonna give it a torch and then I'm gonna go around and clean up my um, guys. I mean, I see some of the uh, white already blooming. Get away that one. Um, I can already see some of the white blooming, so that's a good thing. So I'm hoping on the other side it'll be like that. So let's hope they turn out great because this is my first holographic flower. I hope my insert works great. I mean, and the light is beautiful, so I'm so excited. All right, I will see y'all in a little bit. Hey guys, so y'all ready to see? I'm so excited to see these. I put a, a clear iridescent on the back of it, I guess, because the teal kind of makes it look green, but it's really not. So, we're going to see. I really don't want to get the insert off. I don't want to see the insert on a dirty spot. I'm so excited to see these. I hope these turn out so good. Okay. Let's put the, ins the insert on it. No, let me see if I can get it off because. I can't really feel my fingernails. <laughs> um, did it go under it? Oh no, there it is. That's not going to get me under there. Yeah, it's like a oh, There we go. Okay, I'm just going to pull it off and turn it back over. Put my and another one with the yellow. Insert. And another one. They look really pretty. I think I might have put too much white. From my point of view looking at it, kind of looks a little blotchy, but... I don't care what they look like, as long as they have they got under for some reason. Alright, I don't care what they look like. Well, I do care what they look like, but that was my first time with that teal alcohol ink. And my iridescence. It's got a piece on it. Let me, let me clip it off before we, before we look at it. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to have some cleaning up to do around it. Alright, you ready? These gloves are too big. I've just seen them and picked them up. Alright. Oh, let's see. Oh my god, you can see where you're dusting. I 
I mean, it's a holographic. Oh my god. Oh, it's, it's actually really pretty. What do you think? Look at that. Ah, it worked. I'm so excited. Let's see. Oh, it's so pretty. So, so pretty. Look at that. That is so pretty. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> That's got a lip on it where I had the um, insert in it. No baby. That's so pretty. Look at that. That's so cool. Can y'all see that? Ah. That is awesome. Okay, that looks a little different. But nope. Look at the holographic. I'm loving it. Y'all, I love it. I could have done a better job on the <laughs> um the bloom. But I think I was just too excited and wanted to um see if it worked. I did. I'm so excited. That's awesome. All right. I will get you a close up here in just a second. Yay, it worked. I'm so excited. Y'all, make sure you give me a thumbs up and a subscribe. And I want to keep experimenting because it's fun. <laughs> Alright, thank you for visiting you to find new creations. I am grateful you watch my videos and learn or just get the joy out of watching it. Alright, peace out.